In his 1910 speech to the French Parliament, former President Theodore Roosevelt had this advice for would-be critics and Monday morning quarterbacks. He said, It is not the critic who counts. It's not the man who points out how the stronger man stumbled or how the doer of deeds could have done them better. The credit belongs to the man who is actually in the arena, his face marred by dust and sweat and blood, who strives valiantly, who errs and comes up short again and again, because there is no effort without error and shortcomings, but who actually strives to do the deed, who knows the great enthusiasms, the great devotions, who spends himself in a worthy cause, and who at best, in the end, knows the triumph of great achievement, and who at worst, if he fails, at least he fails while daring greatly, so that his place shall never be with those cold and timid souls who know neither victory nor defeat.